I will be reading excerpts from Chu Shi, The Great Learning. The ancients who wished to manifest their clear character to the world will first bring order to their states. Those who wish to bring order to their states will first regulate their families. Those who wish to regulate their families will first cultivate their personal lives. Those who wish to cultivate their personal lives will first rectify their minds. Those who wish to rectify their minds will first make their wills sincere. Those who wish to make their wills sincere will first extend their knowledge. The extension of knowledge consists in the investigation of things. When things are investigated, knowledge is extended. When knowledge is extended, the will becomes sincere. When the will is sincere, the mind is rectified. When the mind is rectified, the personal life is cultivated. When the personal life is cultivated, the family will be regulated. When the family is regulated, the state will be in order. When the state is in order, there will be peace throughout the world, from the Son of Heaven down to the common people. All must regard cultivation of personal life as the root or foundation. There is never a case when the root is in disorder and yet the branches are in order. When the ruler treats the elders with respect, then the people will be aroused towards filial piety. When the ruler treats the age with respect, then the people will be aroused towards brotherly respect. When the ruler treats compassionately the young and the helpless, then the common people will, fo- will not follow the opposite course. Therefore, the ruler has a principle with which, as a measuring square, he may regulate his conduct. What a man dislikes in his superiors, let him not show it in dealing with his inferiors. What he dislikes in those in front of him, let him not show it in preceding those who are behind. What he dislikes in those behind him, let him not show it in the following those in front of him. What he dislikes in those on the right, let him not apply it to those on the left. What he dislikes in those on the left, let him not apply it to those on the right. This is the principle of the measuring square. Thank you.